Close your eyes and get in touch with your breath. Make this your anchor as you go through the day, otherwise the mind tends to float away with whatever currents come to it, either from outside or inside. But you can keep reminding yourself to say, grounded in the body, grounded in the breath. That helps to put some limits on the amount of useless thoughts, the amount of useless thinking that's going to pull you away. So think of this as your anchor. And the words that come your way, sights, sounds, smells, tastes, tactile sensations, they're like currents in the ocean. They can pull you away, and you know the ocean has storms and has all kinds of other problems, so it gets pulled away to an unsafe place. So you're, you're here in your harbor, where you have some shelter from the storm. The waves don't get really big. They can't crash you. If you go outside your little harbor here, okay, then there's trouble. So try to stay grounded here. Keep reminding yourself each time you breathe in, this is the force of life, and the force of life should go all the way through the body, down to the toes. Otherwise, the body isn't nourished as properly as it could be. We can go without physical food for quite a while, but if you go out breathe without breathing for just a few minutes, you can die. If there's no breath energy in the body. So try to nourish the breath energy in the body as much as you can. This way you can give yourself a task that you, even if your mind doesn't settle down as much as you'd like to, at least you're doing something good for the body, and it's going to have an impact over the long term on your mind. So make this your harbor, and keep remembering that outside of the harbor there are storms. 